Good morning. Well, not even morning time. In Baltimore, good afternoon. Because I got to talk about some good stuff today. It's your boy, and one only. King Trent TV. And I got another video to talk about. Another banger, another special. The Baltimore Orioles have made history. I repeat myself. The Baltimore Orioles have tied a French eyes record yesterday game. That game was crazy as fuck. I ain't gonna hold you. That game was crazy as fuck. Goddamn. It's, uh, it's, it's some stuff I gotta talk about. The Baltimore Orioles came out here and hit fucking not one, not not one, two, three, four, but five, my nigga, five fucking home runs. They hit five fucking home runs, my nigga. They hit five home runs in the game. That's crazy, right? That's crazy. You hit five home runs against a team that's good. For the past couple of years. And that was the Boston Red Sox. You hit five home runs against the Boston Red Sox. Wow. I gotta get the words to clap for that. Wow. You hit five home runs. My man's. Jorge Mateo. Had a home run. My man's. Adley Fucking my favorite player in baseball. Adley Rushman hit a home run. My man's Ryan Matcastle hit a home run. My man's Anthony Santander hit a home run. My man's Ryan Ulyss hit a fucking home run. Five Oriole players hit a home run. And the score is crazy as fuck. Because even we was blowing them out 10 to 4 at one point of the game. Then the Red Sox. Made the game go crazy by making a little comeback and making that bitch close as fuck. They had, they made that shit to like one point to nine to ten. The score was nine to ten. Orioles way still. That's the only reason the Orioles still didn't take the gas, didn't take, still didn't quit. They still fought, you know what I'm saying? They still fought, fought, and got a win. You know why? Because they came out and scored even more runs. Beat them 15 to 10. That game was going crazy. No defense was played in that game. It was just an all-around offensive game. All that game was going crazy. I ain't going to lie. That, the Orioles are, are going crazy. I ain't going to lie. They've been going crazy. Now, they've been on a two-game losing streak. They lost to the uh, Toronto Blue Jays. And they lost to the Chicago Cubs. I ain't going to lie. That, that's kind of bad. But a great bounce back win. This is how you start off a goddamn. That's how you start off a fucking um. Yesterday, yesterday was Friday, so that's how you start off a Friday. You start off a Friday like that, man. That Baltimore, Baltimore team is gonna be good. Uh, hopefully the Orioles, you know what I'm saying, can win today and take the series against the Red Sox, you know, and maybe Sunday sweeping, maybe tomorrow. Maybe, as I'm recording today is Saturday. I want to let y'all know today is Saturday. As I want to know, let y'all guys know. Hopefully the Orioles take a win today, and then tomorrow on Sunday, sweep the Red Sox. Sweep the Red Sox. But the Orioles just got to keep playing, keep playing good. You know what I'm saying? Keep playing magnificent. They playing magnificent baseball right now. I ain't gonna lie. I can't. This team is making me. You know what I'm saying? Real excited again for baseball again. I ain't gonna lie. The past couple of years have been dog shit, but other than that, this team been playing real good. They, ah, man, people keep saying they the baby birds, but I don't know. I might not call them the baby birds if they keep playing like this. They they might become from baby birds to um teenage birds or fucking grown birds now. They might become the grown birds. I don't know. Just saying, but this. This team just had no quit, no quit, no honesty, no quit, or nothing like that. Hopefully, you know what I'm saying, the team can make the playoffs. Hopefully, 
the team can stay, you know what I'm saying, pace, consistency, and keep winning games. Hopefully we can get on a win streak, you know what I'm saying, like we did earlier this year, get on a long win streak, make the record even better. Hopefully we can catch Toronto. Hopefully we can catch Tampa Bay. We are not going to catch the Yankees. The Yankees are far ahead of us. So just let y'all guys know the Yankees are real good this year. So don't keep ahead of yourself thinking y'all going to win the division. We're not, we're not going to win the division. But we can definitely, we can definitely sit here and say we can catch a wild card spot. We can definitely sit here and say that we can catch a wild card spot. We could catch a wild card spot. I'm just so fucking proud of this team right now. This team is coming along. The farm system is working. That farm, let me tell y'all guys know. The farm system is working. That Orioles farm system is starting to work. It's starting to show on the field. Just letting y'all know right now. So like I said, next year, I expect us to be contending for the division. It might be next year we might contend for the division next season. Next baseball season. So I will watch out for that team, man. I will watch out for the Orioles next season. Cause this team might be fucking deadly as fuck. And then whoever will be signed in free agency makes it even more deadly. <clears throat> but that's all jokes aside, you know. The Orioles have won, have a bounce back one against the Red Sox by hitting five fucking Dangers, but not even that. They hit five smack rules, five home runs, my nigga. You know what I'm saying? They hit five home runs. God damn. That's hard to do in baseball, though. It's hard to do that. I just let y'all guys know. It's hard, my nigga. It's hard to hit five home runs in a game as a team. Because it's so many good pitching. You know what I'm saying? It's hard to even hit five home runs in the game. And this team has done that. They hit five fucking home runs. Tied their franchise record. Wow. This team has made me so fucking proud. But all, this, all jokes aside, Orioles, keep playing baseball. Keep doing your shit. Keep doing what you got to do. And I'll catch y'all on the next one. My name is Lawrence Trent. But y'all can call me King Trent. I'm out of here. Peace out my brothers and sisters.